The Education Alliance is building partnerships for the future. The Education Alliance is a statewide nonprofit organization that brings business and community support to public schools. For me, I see a very hopeful and bright future. I see uh, people that are ready to come to the table and um, have a, a meaningful dialogue. I think people are ready to bring support to West Virginia teachers. Um, I think more and more West Virginians understand that our teachers face challenges in the classroom, that they're, they're working hard to solve, but they need an extra helping hand. And so the future to me is bringing those helping hands to support uh, the West Virginia teachers, the principals that are working so hard every day ultimately to make a bright future for our students. The Born Learning Program is a program for three, four, and five year olds. Um, actually anyone under five can come. The students love it. They count down the days. They ask all the time, you know, when, when is the next Born Learning? When is the next Born Learning? Born Learning is an outreach program for us to meet with families who have children five and under, newborn, up to five years old, so that we can get them ready to enter school. Um, the best thing about our Born Learning program has been meeting with some of the families that we otherwise wouldn't have. Well, we're trying to get our preschoolers and our kindergartners, just trying to get them excited and ready to learn. My name is Mark Guerin and I'm an AmeriCorps on the Frontline mentor. What I do is I mentor at-risk students, at-risk being they're either having trouble in academics, behavior, or attendance. We call it the ABCs, it's attendance, behavior, and course performance. The best thing about the program to me is these kids get to see that there are adults other than teachers that actually care about them and want to see them do better and succeed. I'd say the greatest success with the program is the expansion from going from one AmeriCorps school to three and then actually being able to continue to expand upon that and bringing on different partners onto the program. We have been a part of the Education Alliance's STEM uh, network schools for three years now. One of the best things about this program is the opportunity for all students. This program is a great opportunity for students to learn a little bit about STEM and areas of STEM that they might be interested in pursuing. The AmeriCorps VISTA is partnered with the Education Alliance through giving us a grant that allows us to serve at a site. There's a development for both me and the site itself. Education Alliance provided us a lot of training and exposure to other people that have makerspaces. I know George Washington High School here in Charleston has a wonderful makerspace. And we really didn't know what we were looking at, how to do it, how to manage it, how to maintain it. Through the training they've given to us and our exposure to other schools, we have a much better idea of how to do this now. Well, I definitely have learned a lot by just taking this one class at the beginning of the day. I've experienced um, computer classes, learned about hydroponics, I've learned about 3D printing, which I've never been able to experience before, and it's just been a really cool experience uh, learning all of these different things that I couldn't with necessarily like an English class or a science class. After completing our Intro to STEM course, students are going to have the opportunity to study in a variety of STEM-based areas, whether that be science or computer science, and we hope to increase opportunities for students to engage in um, opportunities here, both in our school and in our community. We partner with the Education Alliance in a number of ways. So we can bring financial support to the business, but we also bring our expertise. And I think that's what business can really offer education in general and the Education Alliance specifically is a look into the future because we're always looking into the future at what we need our students to be learning for the future jobs, whether that's artificial intelligence or manufacturing. We can say, these are the skills that are needed in the future, and so we can help provide that kind of expertise to the education field and to the Education Alliance specifically. But we also are looking at the bigger picture of West Virginia and what we need in the state for the future, how we need to move to the next step. 
We're looking at ways that education can help us get students who grow up to be good citizens, who can make critical decisions, have good judgment, can collaborate, and who are innovators. So those are the kinds of things education brings to us. Those are the kind of building blocks that we need to have a good society, to have people who can not only run businesses, but also run our cities and our counties and our state and our country. We all have a role to play in uh, ensuring a bright future for our students. So by bringing uh, business support, community support, by really bringing everyone around the table, I think we do have an opportunity to rally support and to make a bright future for our students.